Hello, everybody. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. In today's game, we have two former Miami Hurricanes getting ready to match up. It's Greg Olson going up against Jimmy Graham. Now let's get you out to Bank of America Stadium for this matchup. It's the NFL on EA Sports, a matchup in the NFC South as we join you from Bank of America Stadium. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Phil Sims. Just prior to kickoff for this primetime extravaganza, and this adds another whole layer of excitement when you have this game under the light. I think you said it right. Center stage, players love it. Anytime you turn on the lights, they know it's special, and it brings out the emotion out of these players. And also, though, let's don't forget, the fans, they've been here all afternoon getting ready, so we're going to have a loud crowd also. The Saints are back deep waiting for the kick. And Graham Gano looks set now to kick it away. Just past the 20, will mark it at the 22-yard line. Here comes the former Super Bowl MVP for the New Orleans Saints, quarterback Drew Brees. Drew Brees can move around the pocket about as much as any quarterback in the NFL and keep his eyes down the field and make throws. He is outstanding at doing that. They come to the line, and it's first down. Breeze in shotgun formation. Throws the pass. Out to Stills. They get to him just in time. One yard shy of the first down. When you throw a slant route, it's really important for the quarterback to make sure he keeps it right in front of the receiver and to his body. Why? So he can make the catch and protect himself. They did it perfectly that time, and that completion almost got him a first down. Offense lines up here. Second and short. And he hauls it in. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down. Jim, that's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. And Ingram's lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. Breeze with the handoff. This run goes nowhere. Stuck for a loss of four. Focusing now on this offensive unit, Marcus Colston is always a favorite target. He is a tremendous target for the quarterback, and I'll tell you this, it doesn't matter if he's covered, he's always open. If you throw it out there and there's tight coverage, he'll find a way to come down with the catch. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. Second and long. Out to the left. Breeze and Colston, a famous combination for years. As we set now, the defense, remember, he was the defensive player of the year in 2013, and he is Luke Keekley. What a year he had in 2013, and I'll tell you what, he had an unbelievable year in 2012. Also, knows how to get to the football, has the instincts and the talent, and man, can he get it done. The Panthers with a nickel look here on defense. Breeze from the shotgun. They're going to get him here for a sack. Well, the defense has got to be excited. Anytime on third down they make the play, uh, they get pretty fired up. But when you sack a quarterback on third down, that is one happy and emotional defense right now.
They're set to punt it away now. a touchback and the ball will be placed at the 20. Heading to the huddle, the quarterback who took his team to the NFC South title in 2013, Cam Newton. Well, when you look back to that 2011 draft, Cam Newton was the first player picked and I think we can all say now he was worthy of it. What a career he's had so far in three years. First down on the way. Offense lines up here. Hand off to Jonathan Stewart. And pick up about four. This offensive lineup often will feature the tight end in a prominent role, and that means Greg Olson. Yeah, Greg Olson from Wayne Hills High School in New Jersey, coached by his father, Chris Olson, terrific high school college player, and how about this? He's a terrific NFL player also. Second and six, Jonathan Stewart with the football for about four. As we look at the defense, one of the real leaders on this unit is linebacker Curtis Lofton. If you're looking for a linebacker to make the right decisions, to read the offensive plays the proper way, then make the tackle, make the play, well, then go get Curtis Lofton because he's that man. Third and two here after the run. Stewart's lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. The Panthers' offensive line does a good job on this run. They show their power. The runner able to go up in there and get a first down. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. The Saints lined up in the nickel. Cam Newton takes it from the shotgun. On the money. He's going to be tackled right around the 42-yard line. How about that? You throw the football behind the line of scrimmage, and the running back catches it and makes a big play out of it. He's able to make people miss, and he can break tackles. This guy is a force. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Newton lines up in the pistol. They run the counter play. He's tackled right at the 48. Nothing like a good trap play. When you play defensive linemen who like to get up the field a little too quick, let them get up the field, have a pulling guard, knock them out, and then run in there behind them and get those yards. Second and four following the run. Receivers stacked up on this play. Benjamin's got it and a first. When you play zone in the NFL, what you're trying to do is make the quarterback hold the football just for a half a second longer, and you hope the pass rush can get there. They don't that time. That's why he got the completion. That wraps up the first quarter here in Charlotte. We'll be back in just a moment for the start of the second. The NFL on EA Sports is brought to you by Head & Shoulders, the official shampoo of the NFL. Not a whole lot of scoring here as we welcome you back to the action. First down here after the completion. Offense lines up here. 
And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Has his target. Rock for a loss on that play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. The Panthers doing their part to spread breast cancer awareness this month in the NFL. Plenty of pink on their uniforms today and throughout the stadium. Second and 11. Handoff to Jonathan Stewart. Good work by the defense. This will be a loss of three. The Panthers know one of the worst teams you can do in the NFL is lose yardage on a run play. They do at that time on second down, and now they have third and long, and the coach is going, well, what do you want me to call? Not many things can work on third and long. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. The Saints defense now is going to go nickel. Easy catch there. No one near him. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third and long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. He'll try this one from 51. kick is good the kick is good from downtown well Jim that field goal puts him in the lead it was a nice drive by the offense and what it does it just gives you confidence you did some positive things on the field and it should carry over for you for the rest of the game about to kick off. Cooks is going to test the coverage this time. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. The Saints break huddle and start their drive this time from the 25. Hooks is a receiver in the slot. The Saints will take the snap from the 25. The outside linebacker that time just did his job very well and gets in there and makes the tackle for no game. try over again on second down on this passing down the defense comes out in the nickel breeze is going to take it from the shotgun finds his mark and picks up maybe three or four that's a good job that time by the quarterback getting that pass completion now makes third down very manageable for him They still face third and six, even after that last successful pass play. Split backfield here. Screen. He's got the catch. They bring him down, and the offense fails to pick up a first down on three plays. Quarterback should have never thrown at that time. Even though he completes the pass, he should have seen the defense was right there. A loss of a couple yards. Morstead will punt this one away. Brown 
Brown's going to look for space now. They'll mark him at the 29. They face first down. Newton has everybody split out wide for this snap. Takes it from the gun. And he's taken down. Well, that's the quarterback's fault. My gosh. The safety, that's who he is supposed to look at at all times when he's under center and when he drops back. He takes his eyes off of him. And what happens? Well, he gets sacked. After that sack, it's now second down and 17. Newton standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Makes the reception. Well, if you're the offensive coordinator here in a third and long situation and you're winning the close game, you'd like to pick this up. But also, you got to make sure you call a play that doesn't put the offense at too much risk. Tough call coming up here for the coordinator. It's third down coming up. Two-minute warning. Coming up at the half, it's the EA Sports Halftime Show, sponsored by Verizon. All right, and welcome back where we've got an offense on that field that wants to try and increase the lead before we move to halftime. This is third down. The defense comes out in the nickel. Here's the handoff. Searching for space to the right. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. That's a timeout by the D. That timeout might be very useful for the offense. They're now ready to go. have to punt the football. And a touchback here. We'll bring the ball out to the 20. Coming up. They're setting up screen. They tackle him for a loss. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Complete, but did not get them the first, so it's second down now. And Morgan's lined up now as a slot receiver. Breeze in shotgun formation. 
He's looking to the right here on this throw. Tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. They'll go shotgun here. He'll throw it over the middle. Harper's there to take him down. The Saints, one timeout remaining. Offense getting set now, following the timeout. the catch it's now second down and one breeze has everybody split out wide for the snap he'll take the snap from the gun finds graham tackle down right around the 47 they're back at the line after that catch for a first down no need to huddle hurry up offense breeze from the shotgun underneath but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete. Second down coming up. Breeze is going to take it from the shotgun. Throws to the right, has his man, and he heads to the sidelines, out of bounds. Well, the way the rules are in the NFL now, you can't hit the receivers, you can't hit the quarterback, and if you give the quarterback this kind of time, he is always going to find an open receiver. Third down on the way. Colston in the slot. In shotgun formation. Launching it deep. Nice catch. Still takes the hit and is brought down. They're going to the hurry up. Back to the line. Tight end in motion. The flag is out as the play continues. Still first down. First down here. Ingram lines up in the backfield. Breeze from the shotgun. He makes the catch. They bring him to the turf. The Saints have to call one right here, and they do, and they are out of timeouts. The offense has had time now to game plan, strategize after the timeout, and now they're ready to go. This will be the eighth play of this drive. The Panthers come out in the nickel. Second down and five. Throws it in the end zone. Touchdown. Touchdown. Nice throw by the quarterback that time. Put it right on the money. Not a big window. It doesn't matter to him today. Great control of the football. Put it right in there for the touchdown. The Saints lined up now for the point after. The point after try is in the books. 
the Panthers in position. Not much time left here in the first half where they're now on the losing end of things. The score's 7-3. Ready to swing his leg as aggressively as possible and send the football down to the end zone. Here's the kick, and this one's just a little squib kick down in the middle of the field. One more snap in halftime. Cam Newton unleashes the long pass. And that's Lewis who almost had the pick. That does it for the first half. Panthers trail on this one. All right, welcome to the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's take a look back now at the first half. Both the Panthers and the Saints haven't had a reliable run game so far. The push up front has not been there, and you have to give credit to both defenses on that front. Here we go. Let's do this. Here's your first half highlights. Saints take over late in the second. Colston's the target here, and that connection will lead to a gain of 14 yards. Still late stages of the second. Steals is the target here, and the play will come to an end after a gain of 35. Still a little time left on the clock. The quick pass, it's complete, and after the short pass, he'll score. The lead grows to four. So that'll do it for us. We'll send you back down to the field where Jim Nance and Phil Sims are on the call. Okay, Larry, looking sharp back in that studio. Thank you for that. And now we're ready to get the third quarter underway as these teams take the field. Morstead will be kicking off momentarily as the second half is about to commence. This big return is going to set up his team in excellent field position. will begin their drive from the 36 now. Ready. Offense lines up here. Picks up eight here. It's now second down. Jonathan Stewart with the football. Tackles made and that'll move the chains. Big first down by the offense that time here in the second half. They're losing a close game. When you get that first down, it just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook. And it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Stewart lined up in the backfield from the gun, Newton. And they advance 
the ball onto the other side of the field. Number one, give us the ball. Game three. This will be second down. Newton in shotgun formation. Good job by the play caller that time. Calling for the short pass. Even though it comes up short of the first down, it opens up many things that you can do on third. You can run a reverse, draw plays, screen plays, or if you want, you can still throw it down the field. Offense needs two yards here on third down after that pass play. In on the stop. Great job by the defense, forcing and recovering the fumble. You said the appropriate word there, forcing. The hit was so solid and so good. The offensive player had no, he had no choice. He had to give up the football. They come to the line of scrimmage, first down. Ingram lines up in the backfield. They'll go draw. Keith leads in on the tackle. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. That leads us to second down. Wide receivers are bunched up. Halfway through the third quarter. Keekley's able to swat the pass away. Well, it's a good thing that linebacker knocked that pass down because I don't think he could have caught it. So if he can't catch it, knock it down so nobody else can catch it. The offense needs six yards here on third down after that incompletion. Third down and four. Snap it out of the gun. Pulls it in. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Defense has ruled today's game, Phil. Yeah, the defense is dominating. And I'm going to be honest, it's fun to watch. Every once in a while, I like to see the offense take a beating to this the NFL, it's all about the offense. It's nice to see the defense dominate. From the gun, Drew Brees ready for the snap. First and 10. Incomplete as he was looking short. Second down. Grams shifted out wide to the left as a receiver. Set up screen. Reaches out and grabs it. The Saints, that time, they can't get big yards, but the throw and catch picks up a few, and his third down's much easier with this situation. Third and four coming up following that completion. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. So that pass is going out of bounds, incomplete.
So now they'll bring out Morstead to punt. And it's a fake. They're running a fake. That's a tackle at the 48. Offense now coming out. Newton's setting up now in the pistol. Now first and ten. Stewart's handed the football. Jordan that time in on the tackle. Close game right now, partner. And you look at the matchup and running back, and neither one of them has really been all that effective. No, Jim, they have not been. I'll say this to the running backs to the coaches, to the offensive line, everybody. Stay patient, stay with the run game, and I think it will work. Offense lines up here. Second down and eight. Handoff to Jonathan Stewart. And he's brought down right at the 43. This is one good tackling defense. They stay in good position at all times, and we saw it that time when they stopped the play for a short game. Third and five after the run. Nickel formation for the defense here. And Newton's going to take it from the gun. He'll fire it out to the left. Has Olsen. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing. But you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities what you can do on the offensive side. Good job by the offense. First down here after the completion. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Jonathan Stewart with the football. Game's five. Good job by the offense getting in the red zone. Now you're down some points. You got to find a way to score a touchdown. Coming up, second down. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. The third quarter comes to a close, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The Panthers' offense tries to continue some momentum, still possessing the football as the final quarter gets underway. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. Benjamin is going to get set in the slot for this snap. Looking to the right side and throwing. Throws it toward the sideline. And what a catch. Hard to throw the football down the field once you get in the red zone. That time the quarterback, well, he knows that. And he looks down there. Nobody open deep. Throws it short. And they get a nice solid pickup on that play call. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. That defensive front looks impenetrable here on the goal line. Stewart's going to take the handoff now. Runs it in for the touchdown. I'd say this run by the offense is just, it's arrogance. They just say, you can't stop us. And they lined up and just shoved it down the defensive throat. Nice run there on first and goal for the touchdown.
the Panthers for the extra point. Extra point is good. The Saints back now for the return, going to look to try and get back on top. Scores 10 to 7. Ready to step up and send this one down to the end zone. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. Now, offense ready for the snap. Ingram lines up in the backfield. Breeze is going to take it from the shotgun. Looking across the middle. Brought down just two yards shy of the first down marker. When you can't hit the quarterback or put pressure on him, there's not much you're going to get done there. That time, quarterback had time. He throws it down the field for another completion. To that grab it's now second down and two the Saints lined up bunch formation Breeze in shotgun formation and he's thrown to the ground well good job that time by the defense they catch the offense off guard and they send more guys than the offensive line can block when you're outnumbered it's up to the quarterback to get rid of the football he does it and he takes the sack See what they do on this third down situation. Colston lined up in the slot. Breeze from the shotgun. Makes the reception. And he's going to be tackled. And that's going to bring us to fourth down. Nice job that time by the defense. Knowing the situation. Go ahead and let the quarterback complete the pass. Just make sure you come up and make the tackle before the first down. Good job. Fourth down coming up. The Saints will punt the football. Brought down at the 25-yard line. It's first down as they head to the line. off to Jonathan Stewart. The tackle by Curtis Lofton. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to, and also it opens up so many other things for your offense. And here we have second down. Olsen's playing out of position in the backfield here. Running to the left side, and they knock him down just a yard away from the first. Now third and short following the run. Benjamins, a receiver in the slot. Newton, 
handoff. Lawson's there that time for the tackle. Good job by the offense picking up a first down there. They've been terrific all day long. They're winning the football game, and they are tiring this defense out. First down here after the run. And now we reach the two-minute warning. Welcome back. Coming out of the two-minute warning here in the final quarter. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. It's a two-tight end formation. Jonathan Stewart with the football. That's Hicks making the stop. They immediately call for a timeout. After that timeout by the defense, play is ready to resume. down coming up Stewart's lined up as the single back handoff made now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field and they'll try to conserve time here with this timeout here after the run they want to keep feeding him the football and he'll go to the left and he's going to be tackled and that's going to bring us the fourth down That timeout might be very useful for the offense. They're now ready to go. And it'll be Nortman back to punt. The good news is they get the football back off the punt, but they've got a long way to go. Yeah, they got a long way to go, Jim, but what you do in this two-minute offense, get it started. Get that first play. I love screens as an opening play in a two-minute offense. Why? Because the defense is going to be back and very conservative. First down. Pressure on every snap now. And Ingram's lined up in a single back formation. First and ten. Wants to go deep. Almost intercepted that time. It's not a good decision by the quarterback. I mean, maybe on the sidelines they keep calling the wrong plays, but he's attacking the strength of this cover two defense. Don't do that. Throw where they're not. That's deep down the middle. Woo! 
Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way. Nickel formation here for the defense. Second and ten. Jimmy Graham with the grab. Trailing every third down so big at this point. They'll go no huddle here as they're out of timeouts. Davis there to make the stop. The Saints head to the line and out of timeouts. They'll go no huddle. First down at the 27. He's looking to the right here on this throw. And he's going to be tackled right around the 37. Second down, late in the fourth quarter. Breeze is going to take it from the shotgun. And it's out of bounds incomplete. Phil, it's third down. They are in four-down territory, and the defense knows that. Yeah, and it, you get a situation like this, Jim, on the defensive side, you need one of your pass rushers to come through and get on that quarterback. Third down coming up, needing a first at this point. Ingram lines up in the backfield. Breeze in shotgun formation. That's an interception. He's into the open. Wow, one a time. Touchdown near the end of this one. You got to love that from your defense. They take a chance. They get the interception. Not only do they do that, they return it a long way for the touchdown. The Panthers now will tack on the extra point. Extra point was good. The Saints getting set to return the kickoff. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. down let's see what they come up with here with about a minute to go they're going to need every break possible first they must score on this possession breeze from the shotgun out to watson you can only take what the defense gives you even though the offense is down here in the fourth quarter they throw it short that was a smart play Every play is huge now. Second down on the way. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. The Saints from the 32. Reaches up high for it, and he's got the catch. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. down coming up time obviously a factor the rest of the way coming to the line hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time gets it out for the completion so much on the line now as they line up for third down going to the hurry up under a minute to go here third and eight the pass down the field by Drew Brees. <laughs> Six. 
They bring back out the offense to go for it. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. The Saints will take the snap from the 45. Heaving it down the field. And it's intercepted, which should all but wrap up this game. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. They come to the line, and it's first down. Olsen's in the slot here for this play. Handoff to Jonathan Stewart. So that's a two-point safety for the defense. memorable game this truly was for Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now and we leave you with the GMC never say never moment of the game